Live from the Kibbe Dome in Moscow, Idaho, it's the Vandals of the University of Idaho hosting the Broncos of Boise State University. It's just about underway here. Just a partially filled Kibbe Dome and Pope sticks his foot into it and drives it deep into the end zone out of the end zone. The Broncos will have it first and ten. First and ten from the 20. Pitch goes to Michael. Turns it up and gets about seven or eight yards. Practice all week. Second down and two. Quick toss outside. Goes to Clinton Jones and Jones runs to the field. He's at the 50. And finally run out of bounds at about the 35-yard line. And Woody, plenty of time. Now the pocket collapses. And down he goes. Puts him down. Once again, has to be a coverage sack. Got a little bit of time back there to throw it. He goes into a, about a, seven, a five to seven step drop. And when he gets there, he's got about two to three seconds to throw. And then the pocket collapses on him again. Throws it across the middle. He's got a man open. The tight end. Lundin is there for the first down. Dinwiddie on the option. Picks it up. Touchdown, Ryan Dinwiddie. And so there's a definite mismatch when those two are hooked up together. Little pooch punt. Gilligan calls for the fair catch, lets it go. And it goes into the end zone. First and ten for the Broncos at the 20-yard line. Dinwiddie, plenty of time, throwing long. He's got Beatty open, and flags go down as Beatty was wide open, and Chris Nathan came right over his back. Beatty starts to slow down to catch the ball. On the defense, 15-yard penalty, automatic first down. See the defender just kind of go over the top of him, gets that arm out, pushes him down, and they make the call. Yeah, right, first down. For his average of last week. Going to be taken at the 20. Fumble. Ball loose. Chris Barrios is down there. They're still unpiling. That's real ugly at the bottom of that pile right now. There's all kinds of unnatural things going on. Broncos say yes. Julius Roberts says they've got it. And look who comes up. Star of the special teams a week ago, Donnie Heck down there. Donnie does a good job of avoiding. He also got pushed in the back, which is yeah. a penalty. But he avoids the ball carrying with this new rule. You don't have to give a halo. All you have to do is allow him to catch the ball. And his own man ran into him. And then the scrum starts. And Brad Allen somehow comes up with the ball. New line. A 42-yard punt that time, by the way. Michael. Big Thompson, back deep. Thompson will take this at the 16-yard line, and now Heck interferes. Johnny Heck did not allow him to make the catch. A 44-yard punt that time. Don't really have that's to. the good news. Don't, don't have to analyze that one too much. Johnny Heck just ran down and ran into the guy, and that's about all there is to be said about that. Motion again. Harrington throws to Need, who's wide open. He beat Travis Berger to the outside and picked up about 10 yards. Just to give up the middle. Harrington goes on to his tight end. McCoy is there and has it at the 15-yard line. The Vandals in great shape. Well, and Harrington's been on the money tonight. Hits him right on stride. Avalos' helmet pop off there at the end, but that takes the Vandals all the way down to the 17-yard line. Harrington will hold. The ball is down. The kick is up. And the Vandals won't be blank. And hasn't been able to do anything so far yet tonight. They're taking it to 23. 35. Crosses the 50, and run out of bounds.
Downs at the 40-yard line. Motion came over on the tight end on the right side. Fake to give up the middle. Dinwiddie throws complete. Let's watch it again. Little play fake in the backfield. And let's see if this ball. Nope, he got it. The Bronco backfield. Gets the call. And has the first down. David Michael down at the two-yard line. Fancy front. Dinwiddie out of the eye formation this time. Give it to David. Michael hit at the two, fumbles the ball in the end zone. And Idaho has it. This is tough. Quite an impact here at the goal line. Pops that ball out. Anderson hit him. Mike Anderson. Hit him right in the numbers. And then Andrew Stobart gets the loose ball. All right, they will go in punt return formation. Gilligan is back. And Gilligan's going to let it go. And the Vandals are going to down it inside the 10-yard line. Feet. Dinwiddie, plenty of protection. Now it starts to bring down to Beatty. Beatty's at the 20. He's got the first down to the 27-yard line. Derek Schumann has checked into the lineup at tight end. Double tight end. Heck again. Popped up the ball. And the Vandals say they have it. The second fumble of the night. And Daryl Murphy has the ball. Great field position. Watch it here. His heck, arm just a little wide. The Vandals will take over in one of the best spots they've had tonight. Lando Winston come wide to the left. Octave is wide to the right. Harrington sets, throws across the middle, complete to the tight end McCoy for the first down inside the 20-yard line. Into the end zone, and Ido has their first touchdown of the year. Brian Pope kicks it off deep. David Michael has a chance to run it back. He's at the 20. And spun down at about the 23, 24 yard line. Hermeda. Michael cuts to his right, runs past Murphy, and is close to a first down. Fake the blitz. Pass complete to Gilligan. Jerry Smith in motion. Quick toss to Smith. Smith turns up, has the first down. 26 yard field goal attempt is good. Despite the high snap, Tyler Jones gives the Broncos a seven point lead with 7.56 left to play in the ball game. Gilligan calls a fair catch this time. The Broncos, Dinwiddie has Gilligan in motion this time. The give to Michael. Over his right tackle. He's got the first down. He's still going. Breaks a tackle at the 50. And there he goes. David Michael takes it all the way to the barn. David Michael with a sensational run. Speed, tailgate, run red lights. You're an aggressive driver at least part of the time. Three seconds left and that's the ball game. Stay with us. The players are celebrating a 24-10 victory.